right, butterflies, it is another Sunday financial sit down. I guess I need to say that at, at, um, at the beginning of each one because this is what we got, you know, everybody decided on. So the Sunday financial sit down is where we're at today. <laughs> so um, what I wanted to talk to you about today, um, since it's almost the end of the month, on Ditching the Debt, you guys make sure that you go over there um, to the Facebook group and um, become a member. We have such a good time. We have a lot of inspiration. We have a lot of suggestions. We have a lot of support. So I would love for you guys to come um, just do a search for groups um, with Ditching the Debt. Oh, okay, so me and my big mouth, I decided to put out a challenge for January. It wasn't a specific challenge. Whatever you wanted to give up for the month of January, <laughs> we had everything from um, like yarn or material, um, going out to eat, um, doing a pantry thing. We had all kinds of people um, coming up with all kinds of different things that they were going to do in the month of January. Well, I was going to give up, get you know, not doing any fast food so i know once a month i have to go to a meeting um so i had saved out ten dollars for that that was it i was spending on that but other than that i was not going out child please <laughs> that did not work it did not work it was an epic fail i've already confessed to them they know it's an epic fail epic epic fail epic fail one, because there's a lot of stuff. I have an extra child here that I am not, um, I was not planning on her being here. <laughs> Brie moved back. I love my baby, but, you know, me and Janae had our little, you know, grocery list down pat. We knew exactly what we were eating. She got what she wanted. I got what I wanted. We were good. And then we add Brie in. And Bree's like, well, wait a minute. I'm going to eat a little bit of this. I'm going to eat a little bit of that. And then we go to look for something and there's nothing there because what we've planned for, at least for that week, is gone because she's eating it. And I'm like, are you kidding me? So, I don't even know where to start. It's just too much to even tell y'all about that part of it. And it's not that I don't want to share, but it's her situation, her story. So I'll leave that be. But it has affected my grocery budget. It has affected um, how we're moving forward and trying to stay within the budget. So um, me and Janae had to go out on a couple of occasions. And so... There you have it. The other ladies have been doing very well um, thus far. Everybody seems to be doing good. But what I did decide is that I do need to add, I do need to be realistic with myself. I need to realize that we do like going out to eat, but I think I need to do that money in cash. And when it's gone, it's gone. I think to go cold turkey for us is probably not the best thing. Now, it's not a situation where we go through, you know, well, I guess, you know, it's just little stuff. It's almost like, a, you know, death by a thousand cuts. It's, you know, a, a $3 meal here. Or, you see what I'm saying? And so it's a little bit um, hard to kind of even keep track of it because I'm just swiping. So I think I'm going to do, you know, a set amount. I'm going to look at February's budget and just see... What is a realistic number for me and Janae? Bree's on her own. And then we just kind of go from there. So tell me if you guys did any no spins or anything down at the bottom. <laughs> and um, make sure you guys subscribe. I love all of my new um, subscribers. I am still asking you guys to do your wins. I've got a couple, but I want a few more that I so I can go ahead and do like a little segment at the end. Um, so tell me, you know, it, did you pay off something? Did you get your baby step number one? Hell, did you get out of baby step zero? <laughs> that would be me. Hello, I'm coming out. Um, 
So just let me know um, if you have, you know, done something fabulous with your budget. If you stayed in budget that month, you know, I want to be able to support you guys and love on you guys as much as you love on me. So make sure that you leave those things at the bottom. So until next time, butterflies, love you.